Hello and welcome back to my magical chamber. I am the Soul Enchantress. And today's topic is about why you may be facing the same challenges over and over and over again. Okay, so this video is inspired by clients that I've decided not to work with. Okay, um, I'm not someone who takes on clients just for the sake of um, gaining clients or uh, creating growth in my work or anything like that. I believe in soul infused wealth, which means I don't focus on the prosperity side of my work because the prosperity, wealth and money flow in my work is looked after if I look after my clients and I truly believe that. So my focus is on the type of clients that I want to help and that is my soul's calling to help. So everyone's soul's calling and soul's purpose has a specific niche within a broader segment. So my calling is actually to help clients who want to soar higher than they ever have before, who truly want to experience the juiciness, the deliciousness and the joyousness of every facet of their lives and to be able to draw it in, to be able to elevate themselves and their vibrations, to be able to become prosperity magnets for love, for um, wealth, for joy, for luck, for happiness and peace and balance and truly enjoy a gorgeous, gorgeous physical existence for the brief time that you are in this body and at the same time be able to align with what your soul is truly calling for you to create, to become, to be. Okay, so that is the, that is the work I do and every now and again I decide that there are specific clients that I actually won't work with anymore because they may not be ready to do the kind of work that uh, is demanded of them in a way by their soul and sometimes uh, it's because a client is not ready to face their fears and their internal demons because if you that I believe is true bravery being able to confront your own inner fears and your own inner demons to overcome them to slay those fears and to rise above it and truly grow your life and harness what you came here to do and be who you came here to be that is true courage okay so you can do a lot of things you can be an egotistical you could be as arrogant as you want you can think you're successful in this life and be ruthless and try to do all things physically possible to manipulate others and yourself and work around your fears but if you can't face your internal fears your internal shadows and your internal demons and be able to overcome that well you that that's not bravery that's actually quite covered cowardly and if someone is not ready to do that and is not willing to accept the help to do that then I actually don't work with them because I want them to get to a point where they are actually willing to accept the help and to step into their true power I want you to be powerful I want you to be able to harness your innate greatness because that is my calling my calling is to help you to become truly great for you to become who you are meant to be okay so that is what I help my clients to do and this is purely something that I am driven to create um, this video and it is inspired by by what I just told you about um, um, of clients that I don't want to work with but it is for you if you are listening and you are 
inspired by this message, then you are ready to face your fears. So what I'm trying to get across to you is that I've been guided to offer this message. And even though it's inspired by uh, people that I don't want to work with, uh, it is a message for those who are ready. Okay, if you can kind of get that double meaning. The reason that you may be facing the same challenges over and over and over again is because you are actually not working on the causes of those challenges. So that same challenge will appear in so many different forms. But if you get to the root cause of each of those challenges, whether it is a block in money and prosperity, whether it is a block in trying to find a relationship or trying to keep a relationship or start a relationship, whether it is a block in not being able to uh, increase your self-confidence, whatever the case may be, you will find that they will appear in different guises, but at the end of the day, the root of that challenge has not been addressed okay so but in order for you to address the root of that challenge and to eradicate it and to actually build a bridge so you can walk over it and start to grow the areas that seem to be stagnant or dead or going backwards you need to be ready to face your fears and Ask for the help that you need and ask for the help from someone who can actually guide you, hold your hand and walk with you every step. But you yourself has to come to the realization that you are willing to face your fears, you are willing to slay those demons and you are willing to build a bridge across your fears and walk to the other side so that you can become the greatness that you truly are. I hope this has been helpful and um, if you would like to work with me or you um, want to discuss this further in terms of how uh, soul work or enchantments or any of the sessions that I offer can help you to elevate yourself and draw in what you desire or if you are um, unsure as to what you need to do first, then please, I would love to hear from you. The easiest way to contact me is through my website, soulenchantress.com. I wish you a joyous day. Blessings.